doesn't matter who you play. You can't have 22 turnovers and uh, 50, give up 15 offensive rebounds and shoot that poorly from the free throw line and, and expect to be in a contest. Give the guys a lot of credit for fighting back, tying the game, taking the lead, and then you know um, getting to that point. But that's our that's what we are. It's our growth, and we have to um, we have to. Um, prepare from there. Everybody kind of has their own unique stamps and um, you got to be prepared to face it and you got to be prepared to do a, a good job versus, um, you know, uh, the many different, you know, styles of basketball that, uh, that there are out there. Um, and, you know, they, they do. They have a very unique style of play and it, it disrupted us. It stopped us from running some of our offense and um, told the guys, I said, this isn't going to be a pretty game. It's going to be you know, challenging. And to their credit, honestly, they did, a, they did a pretty good job of executing their plan. Now, we settled in. I, I don't know what the halftime score was. I think it was 34 to 30 or something to that effect. So, I mean, again, I give the guys, our guys a lot of credit. I mean, we did come back. You know, we made a run. Um, we took the lead. And, um, you know, we couldn't sustain. Um, you know, they executed well on the offensive side, and we didn't defend it well enough. I think we stepped up our defense in that long run we had. We really shut them down, and they didn't really execute any of their offense. And then going after that, uh, we just stopped playing. Like he said, they really executed that pick and pop with their five, and that kind of ended our run. But in that big 18-2 to run that we had, I think mainly our defense caused that.